I just found a way to use Clean 1.5 for free with no watermark. With this same technique, you can use MinMax, Runway, and Luma for free as well. We all know how unbearable waiting for Kling's free plan is. It could even take days, only for it to come with a watermark. Well, this technique only takes about 10 minutes at this moment. Now, this technique works as of the recording of this video, so hop on it before it's too late. If you want to learn how to get more credits, watch till the end. I've curated a document of prompts, techniques, and settings on how to use these tools for free. If you want it, click on the share button and copy the link. Then comment, I want the guide once my AI sees you've done it, it will send it to you. Now at the end, I would show you a cool video to video tool to turn real videos to anime. So stay tuned. Let's get started. Like the video and subscribe for more free AI content. So first of all, if we want to use it for free, let me show you this. Under any tab, search for Kling AI. Click on the first link you see. Once you get here, as you can see, there's already a trial pop-up on the screen urging us to pay. However, if we do this, we might need to put in our credit card information or our generations will still have watermarks, which isn't ideal. Now you can sign in. Currently, I think they are having errors when it comes to logging in, but that's beside the point. You see, the free tier is a bit of a hassle. Not only do you have limited credits, but there's also a watermark and generations take forever. And I'm not joking. Some can take up to a day. But don't get me wrong, Kling is one of, if not the best, video models out there. Ideally, if you want to go full-time into this, you should definitely consider their plans. But for those who can't afford it, there's a way to use even their pro model. Yes, Kling Pro. For free, with credits. And it doesn't waste hours, literally about 10 minutes for each generation, and no watermark. At the very end, I'll show you how to get more credits. All of this is accurate as of this moment, they might make a change in the future. Create a new tab and search for Kyber AI. Don't worry, you'll see how we'll integrate it with Kling, so watch closely. So Kyber, and not Claybeer actually. You should be in this interface. You see, Kyber isn't really a video model. There's a wide variety of tools you can use here and they give free credits per account. Sign up for now, I'll use my Google account. Once you sign up, there should be a tour. Just skip it. One thing to notice is that they give 200 credits per account for free. When you're done, click on Create New Canvas and click Try. Or actually go back. There are a lot of tools you can use here. Let's first use Flux Realism and see how it works. This uses Flux 1.1 Ultra, which I think is the latest. Type in your prompt as usual. When done, click on the blue smiley face. This costs only five credits, which is generous. And note, this isn't sponsored by Kyber. It's done. And it didn't take much time. If you zoom in, you can see how high the quality is. It's ultra realistic, you wouldn't tell it's AI generated. What makes this better is that you can use many more tools completely for free. Now, let's use Kling. Go here and create a new canvas. Now you can clearly see all the big video models, like even Runway, that they have. First of all, let's test out the plain Kling and wait around because there's a trick to exclusive content. As you can see, it says Kling would be a bit slow, but do not worry. The maximum wait is about 10 minutes. Type in your prompt as usual. For now, I'll copy this prompt to test it with other models. The best part is that this version only consumes 15 credits. Remember, watch till the end as I'll show you how to get more credits for free. Like normal claim, you can select how long it should take, though it increases the credits. For now, we'll leave it at 5 seconds. You can also select the aspect ratio, but we'll leave it as is. Click Generate, and let's see what it gives us. This is the result, and as I said, it took roughly about 10 minutes, which is way better than the normal Kling AI on a free plan. Another great feature is that you can download it here, and it won't have a watermark. Let's try the latest Kling version. Paste this, and come over here. It seems more Canvas is a paid feature. What you can do is go over to the Flow menu and select Kling Pro. Paste in the prompt. As we can see here, this version consumes a whole lot more credits. Let's test it out to see the quality. It's done now, and this time it took about 9 minutes, which is awesome. You can see it did a really good job. If you're wondering why it's not 2D, it's because I didn't prompt it well. I first said 2D, then went on to say Cyberpunk style, probably something prompting would fix. Let us use it to generate AI influencer videos. So for the best prompting, we'll open up ChatGPT. This is what we're going to tell it to do. Create a mirror selfie of a woman, fully clothed. When done, press enter and wait for it to generate. Once done, copy this prompt and paste it back into Kyber. 
Remember, this is Kling Pro we're using. Maybe I'll add something to the prompt to like describe her hair. Click generate and let's see the result. It's done in about 11 minutes. Look at the quality of the output. As you can see, no weird movement or lighting, no disfigured morphing. Everything looks almost perfect. And as usual, you can download with no watermark. You can make this 10 seconds long and it's completely free as of the recording of this video. You might notice we've run out of the necessary credits to run Kling. How do we get more? Let's try MinMax to see if our credits suffice. Unfortunately, we don't have enough credits for MinMax either, but that's not a problem. Let's get more credits for free. So pay close attention here to not miss anything. Create a new tab and search for tempmail.org. Once there, they'll give you a free temporary email address. Copy it. Go back to Kyber and log out. Make sure you've downloaded all your generations. Under account sign out. On the sign up page, paste the temporary email address. Go through the usual sign up process. If they send a verification email or one time password, check your temp mail inbox. You should see what they send here. You can also use other means to sign up and test it all out, then test out MinMax as usual. Paste the same prompt and let's see what MinMax does. As usual, click on Generate. MinMax is done. Look at the result. It did well with realism, but didn't quite understand the prompt, so it looks odd. You can also try the image to video function. Now let's use Kling with this image since it's the best AI video generator. Let's see how it performs. Kling is done and look at the result, it's wonderful. No weird morphing, clean movement and consistent background. You could increase this to 10 seconds. This is a cool way to use Kling Pro for completely free. So now let's try out the cool video to video tool. For that, go under the flow menu and scroll down. Choose any version of the video rest dialer. I chose this version. Now upload in your video. Now for some odd reason, the version one won't let me. So I switched to version two and I've uploaded my video. Now under aesthetic, you choose the style you want under this paint icon. Select any from their library and use. Now for subject, it's simple. Here, all you need to do is describe what exactly is going on or happening in the original video you uploaded. When done, you can go here to intensity and mess around with the value. With all of that over, generate it. It's done, this is the result. Not the best, but definitely something prompting can fix. Or you can mess around with the intensity value a bit. Also, you could change styles and see how it works. That's it for this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more AI content.